Good morning, Pastor Brian here. Thank you for joining me today as we read a psalm a day. Today, Psalm 21. I'll be reading from the Common English Bible. The king celebrates your strength, Lord. Look how happy he is about your saving help. You've given him what his heart desires. You haven't denied what his lips requested. You bring rich blessings right to him. You put a crown of pure gold on his head. He asked you for life, and you gave it to him all right. Long days, forever and always. The king's reputation is great because of your saving help. You've conferred on him glory and grandeur. You grant him blessings forever. You make him happy with the joy of your presence. Because the king trusts the Lord, and because of the Most High's faithful love, he will not stumble. Your hand will catch all your enemies. Your strong hand will catch all who hate you. When you appear, Lord, you will light them up like an oven on fire. God will eat them whole in his anger. Fire will devour them. You will destroy their offspring from the land, destroy their descendants from the human race, because they sought to do you harm. They devised a wicked plan, but they will fail because you will make them turn and run when you aim your bow straight at their faces. Be exalted, Lord, in your strength. We will sing and praise your power. It's the end of Psalm 21. What kind of psalm do you think this psalm is? One of the things that really uh, stuck out to me is in the past when we've looked at some of these psalms, there's been this comment and conversation uh, by David about the different ways in which uh, the psalmist is looking for God and wondering where God is in the midst of all the enemies that are around him and the enemies that are prospering, knowing that they will fall but uh, or fail, as this text puts it, uh, but still just wondering and waiting for that time. And this psalm seems to be all about seeing that time in which uh, the wicked fail. So I just think it's kind of an interesting change of events, maybe, that that time has finally come, or that there's been a specific example of when this has happened in David's life, in the psalmist's life. So I just think that that's a, a really interesting change in what we've heard in the past. So what did you hear? What did you like? What didn't you like? Uh, write it down. Share it with a friend. Share it with us. Take care of yourselves. Stay safe. And God bless.